you can make over $200 a day using TikTok. It's one of the easiest ways to make money online. Today, I'm going to show you how to make money off TikTok without showing your face. Best thing about it is you do not need a computer. You can do it from anywhere and you can build a huge following. I'm going to go through step by step on how you can start your own faceless TikTok page and start making money online. Now you're probably asking how are we going to make money on TikTok? There are three main ways to make money on TikTok. Number one, the creator fund. This is where TikTok pay you dependent on how many views a video gets. The creator fund is a fund of over 231 million pounds. There is no limit on how much you can earn. The sky is the limit. The better a video does, the more money you can make. To be applicable for the creator fund, you need to have the following. You need to have 100,000 views over the last 30 days, 10,000 followers, and be 18 years old. Initially, you may look at that and think that's gonna be hard to hit. Now guys, I've been creating faceless TikTok pages for years, and I can honestly tell you right now, it's extremely easy to hit those requirements. And I've managed to hit them on brand new pages within two to three days. Anyone can do this. It doesn't matter what your age is. It doesn't matter what your experience is. Literally, if you follow the steps in this video, you can start earning money very quickly with TikTok. The second way you can make money on TikTok is through affiliate marketing. This is when you advertise services or products through your TikTok page, and if anyone was to purchase the product or service, you will receive a cut of the sale. For example, let's say you have a pet TikTok page and you advertise a product that is for pets. If the product costs 50 pounds and you make 5% commission from the sale and someone was to purchase that product, you'd earn two pounds 50 pence. Now, this may not sound like a lot, but bear in mind, if you get 1 million views and 1% of those people purchase that 50 pound product, you'll earn 25,000 pounds. Number three, TikToks create a marketplace. Once you hit the requirements to join the TikTok Creator Fund, you'll then unlock the TikTok Creator Marketplace. Here, hundreds of businesses are asking creators to market their product or service for some money or to have the product completely free. Here, you can negotiate with the company your terms to do this. I just wanna show you one of my pages on TikTok. As you can see, I've got over 141,000 followers. And as you can see, I've got you know 1.7 million views here, 1.1 million, 1.2 million. There's a lot of videos that have done well uh, for example, here you can see 336K. As you can see, guys, it's extremely, extremely easy to get views on this. So I'll show you what type of videos we're gonna be making today. But as you can see, this is one of my videos. I want this, I want this. I wanna do what Jake Paul could in, knock you out. As you can see, the videos are very easy. This one's about sports, but I've mainly done boxing as boxing seemed to be the most popular one. I haven't actually uploaded in a while. And as you can see how much money I've actually made. So currently just on the creator fund, I've made over 1,414 pounds. That is a lot of money. And again, I've made a lot more through affiliate marketing as well as the TikTok creator marketplace as well. The amount of money you can earn can be life changing. So let's get straight into the steps so you guys can start your very own faceless TikTok page. Step one, creating your page. Now, before you begin creating your TikTok page, you need to know what niche you're going to go in. I would recommend extremely popular niches, for example, TV shows, boxing, reality TV series, etc. I would recommend something you enjoy. For example, if you're into sport, I would say create a page around a particular sport. Honestly, the best way to grow is to niche down as much as possible. So for example, some people do TV shows and they do a particular TV show like Friends. And what they would do is create clips around certain episodes of 30 seconds of maybe important things that they've said or some funny things that they've said, make that into a video and then post it. In this example, I'm going to create a page around football interviews. So first thing I need to do is create a name. So if we go onto TikTok, we're gonna click on sign up. The next thing we're gonna do is click on use phone or email. Now just put your birthday in. The next thing it's gonna ask you is your phone number or email address. I would recommend creating a separate email address for this. So I've just got an email address that I've already made. I'm just gonna put that in there. Once you put in the email address, it will then ask you to create a password. So just put in any password. The next thing it's gonna ask you is to create your nickname. Now, this is what you name your page. So I'm gonna go with footy interviews. So as you can see now, the page has been created and you can see it says footy interviews and my at is footy interviews zero. Now I can change this. However, for the sake of the video, I'm just gonna leave it as it is. Now I'd recommend you try to choose a name that's not taken as that will be your best chance to grow this TikTok page. So now, as you can see, we've created the TikTok page now the next thing we need to do is create a logo so you can obviously use canva adobe illustrator to create your logo however if you want to make it easy for yourself and the easiest way to get your logo created is to go on this website over here so i'll leave the link in the description 
This is the website we're gonna go into to create our logo. So all I'm gonna do is type in my page name. Then the next thing it's gonna ask you is what type of business is it? So just label it whatever niche you're in. So in my case, it's football, so I'm just gonna select football. It will then ask you what sort of color scheme you wanna go in. I mean, just choose something you like. The next thing you'll ask you is some fonts. Again, just choose anything that you like. Then what's gonna happen is you're gonna get your logos generated here. All you've got to do is pick a logo that you like. So let's have a look. Now I found a logo I like, and again, I know it says that you need to purchase the logo. Honestly, guys, the easiest way to bypass this is literally screenshot that logo and crop around it. So I'm gonna show you exactly what I mean by that. So all you've got to do is literally screenshot, and then I literally just go around the logo like this, and there you go, you've got your logo. All you've got to do is save it to your photos, and now you've got that logo without having to pay anything. After you've done that, you just need to add your logo onto your TikTok page. All you've got to do is click on edit profile, change photo, upload photo, select your logo, which is here. And I'm just going to select the actual logo itself rather than having the text in there. And all I'm then just going to click is save. That will then save it onto your TikTok page. And now you can see your TikTok page looks a lot better. The next thing you need to do is add a bio. Now you can add anything on this bio. I always like to add the most active blank page on TikTok. In regards to the blank, I'm talking about what niche you're in. So for example, in my case, the most active football page on TikTok. You can add a few more things, whatever you think is relevant for your bio. I generally like to just add that. This lets people know that I am active in posting, so they are more likely to follow me. Okay, so once we've done that, we now move on to step number two. Also guys, if you're enjoying the video so far, make sure you smash the like button and make sure you subscribe to the channel. Step two, creating content. Now we are gonna create content around this. The best way to do football interviews, as there are a lot of interviews on YouTube, is literally go onto the YouTube app and screen record a particular interview. Now what I'm gonna do is find a popular interview with maybe a popular player that had something really interesting to say. I can either go with the latest interviews or more popular interviews that happened maybe a few months ago or even a few years ago. So now I'll show you how I create my content for TikTok. So what we do is we go onto YouTube and I'm going to search a particular football interview. Now I'm gonna go with the infamous one with Piers Morgan and Cristiano Ronaldo. So all I'm gonna type in is Ronaldo, Piers Morgan. As you can see, I've got the full interview interview over here so just going to click on that now what i'm going to do is find a part that i like and then start screen recordings so now that i've screen recorded that interview what i'm going to do is download an app called CapCut. now i've already got the app and you can use apps such as InShot and other editing apps on the phone however i find CapCut the best app to use so if you haven't got CapCut, just go onto the app store and search in CapCut. now once you download CapCut, you're just going to open CapCut. so i've got CapCut over here what you then do is click on new project and then you add your screen recording onto the app so now that i've added the video you'll see something along the lines of this you'll have your video here playing and now what we're going to do is edit the content to fit on TikTok. First thing we're gonna do is click on where it says ratio. We're gonna select the first one which says TikTok on there. Once you click that, you can now start editing your video. So I'm just gonna crop out the unnecessary parts. Now that I've edited the video, what I'm gonna do is zoom in so it fills the whole screen. So all you've got to do to do that is literally click on the clip on the timeline and then just with two fingers, zoom in and get it to where you would want. So for example, in this case, I've got it onto Ronaldo's face. And now if I play the video, it's something that I regret to left from the stadium, probably. So the next thing you're going to do here is add music. Now I'll show you exactly the best way to add music. You can either screen record a video on YouTube and then you can extract the audio onto your actual timeline. Now, just for the sake of the video, I'm not going to add any audio just for the sake of copyright. The next thing that I do is I like to add captions, especially as it's interviews. So what I'll do is click on text. As you can see at the bottom, it says auto captions. So all I do is just click on that. Now what this is gonna do is create captions for me. So it's gonna elevate the video and make the video a lot better when you add captions. So as you can see, the captions are there. Now I normally change the format and the font and the colors. So I'll show you quickly how I do that. So I just click on the text itself. I click on style. Now when you do that, it will start changing all of the captions for you. I normally go with yellow as that stands out the most. You can also add a stroke to it and then I change the font. Now you can choose any font. You can also add your own fonts as well. I normally go with the font postmodern. So as you can see, I've changed my font. I can also make the text bigger. I normally do something along the lines of this. And as you can see, guys, if I play the video now. It's something that I regret to left from the stadium, probably. Or maybe no, I don't know. It's difficult to 
to tell you. So as you can see, the captions aren't bad. It actually picked up everything correctly. So now that you've done that, all you need to do is export the video. So now to export the video, all you've got to do is click on the top right over here and it will say exporting. Now the video will be saved in your camera roll. Once you have exported the video, we can now move on to the final step. Step three, posting on TikTok. Now you need to go onto TikTok. You'll see the plus button at the bottom over there. Click on upload and then you'll see your video on the bottom right. Make sure you click that. As you can see, my video is there now, it's playing. Then you've just got to click next. Now here you've got to put hashtags. Now hashtags allow your video to be found. So what I tend to do is put a lot of hashtags relating to the content I'm talking about. And I like to add other hashtags as well, stuff like FYP. I also add this hashtag here, FYP with a little smiley face. And then that's pretty much it. You can then select a cover. So what I tend to do here is something that will grab the viewer's attention, something like that. And then all you've got to do is hit post. That really what that's going to do now is post your video, which you'll see in the top left. And that's it, guys. That's all you do. Now, the video will get a lot of views. The reason it will get a lot of views is, again, if you've chosen a popular niche like I recommended to, people will end up watching the video. They will follow. They will like. And again, I've done this with many, many TikTok pages, and I've managed to grow them all over 100,000 followers. I'd also recommend posting three to five times a day to maximize your growth. Once you hit 10,000 followers and get 100,000 views in the last 30 days, you'll then be able to join the Creator Fund where you will start earning money. If you have any questions or you're stuck on anything, make sure you put it down in the comments below. Thanks very much watching make sure you share subscribe and like and i'll catch you guys for another video